You're now officially a high school graduate. Feels so good to say that, and it sure makes me feel very emotional. Now please remember, there's no such thing as an elevator to success. We all have to take the stairs, and your high school diploma is a step. Don't stop and keep climbing those stairs. Buenos dias, familias, amigos, personal escolar y compañeros. Es un placer para mí poder darles hoy en este día la bienvenida a celebrar la clase 2021 de la Escuela de Adultos Fairfield Susun. Felicidades a cada uno de ustedes. Todos estamos muy orgullosos por su dedicación y determinación para poder obtener esto. Lo hicimos. Así es, hicimos posible esto y todo nuestro gran esfuerzo no fue en vano. Todos tenemos una historia, una razón o motivo diferente por la cual estudiamos aquí. Pero hoy lo logramos. Oficialmente nos graduamos de la escuela preparatoria. No sé ustedes, pero qué bien se siente decir eso. Y en lo personal me causa muchas emociones. Ahora recuerden este consejo. No hay y no existe ningún elevador para poder llegar al éxito. Debemos subir por la escalera, paso a paso. Y este diploma que hoy obtendremos es el primer escalón de muchos más. Así que no paren y sigan subiendo esa escalera. Congratulations. Felicidades. Thank you, Guadalupe. We are pleased to have people here today to celebrate this graduation. And I would like to take a moment to recognize and thank them all. First, we have representatives from the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District joining us. From the Unified School District, we have our superintendent, Chris Corey, our board vice president, Bethany Smith, board member, Helen Tilly, board member, Anna Patero, Board member Judy Honeychurch, Assistant Superintendent of Educational Services, Dr. Sheila McCabe, Assistant Superintendent of Human Resources, Ken Whitmore, Assistant Director of Secondary Education, Liz Sanders, and Director of Special Education, Dorothy. I'm Rothbaum. Rothbaum, and I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I know that I speak for the graduates and staff and thanking you for your support over the last many, many years, and especially for your guidance throughout this unprecedented year. Second, I would like to recognize and thank the staff at the adult school for their efforts in helping the graduates realize their goal and all of the amazing work they did this year, and especially in this last month. When I announce your name, I ask that you please stand and be recognized for your hard work and dedication to our students. Our counselor, Loretta Garcia, who advised and encouraged our graduates and served as an invaluable resource during the course of their studies. And Rosaba Elias, our registrar, who diligently maintained transcript and student records. And of course, none of you would be here today if it weren't for the dedication commit and commitment of your teachers. Mary Hughes, June Alexander, Peter Vadney, Melissa Strain, Scott Null, and Janie Mitchell. I also want to recognize our dedicated paraprofessionals, Amy Beckendorf and Gladys Melton and our outstanding clerical staff, Irma Calderon, Margarita Ponce, Maria Zaldivar, Maria Deneen, Yesenia Pantoja, Berenice Ventura Andrade, and Cassandra Elias. Again, they have worked tirelessly throughout this year, and especially in the last few weeks, and I thank them all so much. And finally, I'd like to recognize and thank the family and friends who are here today. You have encouraged these graduates to reach their goal of earning their high school diploma or GED. And the graduates thank you and we thank you. And now for a few words from our superintendent, Chris Corey. 
Let's also get a huge round of applause for the principal and assistant principal of the adult school. Wow, graduates, you did it. Congratulations to our Fairfield Sassoon Adult School graduates, class of 2021. This accomplishment today speaks volumes about you and who you are. For you as adults to make your education a top priority during this crazy, chaotic pandemic is truly remarkable. You were faced with many hurdles and challenges, but you persevered and you pushed through to reach this goal. Going to school as an adult is a huge, or a huge commitment. Many of you juggled a work schedule along with your school schedule. Perhaps you are also busy assisting your own children with their distance learning this year as you also were completing your studies. Oliver Wendell Holmes said, a mind once stretched by a new idea never regains its original dimensions. You will never be the same. Your mind has stretched. Our hope is that this achievement for you today, it only marks the beginning of your educational journey. We are all so overjoyed to be able to recognize you in person today in this time-honored tradition of having you walk across and receive your diploma. On behalf of the Fairfield Sassoon Governing Board, our entire district, our staff, and our community, congratulations graduates, continue to shine. Thank you, Superintendent Corey. I am so happy that so many of you wanted to have come today. I think one of the many lessons that we learned over the last 16 months is the importance of coming together and celebrating. This is a very important milestone. For some, it's a lifelong dream. For others, it's the first step towards a new career. But for all of you, it's a fantastic achievement. Now, I know that most of us want to forget 2020 graduates. However, I think it's important for you to remember to remember your sacrifice. You had to work hard, make tough choices. Success always requires some kind of sacrifice. To remember how you hustled. You did things other people didn't do and you did them with a sense of purpose because you were focused on your goal. Remember the grit that it took, the strength of character to finish something that you started. Remember your persistence. You have done something that no other graduating class can claim. You earned your diploma during a pandemic. You didn't give up despite the world being turned upside down. To remember that you were flexible when circumstances changed, which they did every day last year, you kept your mind and attention on what you were trying to achieve. To remember your mindset. You had to go, change from a no, I can't to a yes, I will. And this attitude will continue to benefit you in the future. To remember your success, how it felt when you were finishing your last few credits or answering the last questions on the final GED test, when you could see the finish line. And finally, it's important to remember all of the people have supported you on this journey, your family, your friends, your teachers, your employers, your colleagues, your children. These are the people that helped you reach this incredible goal. So when you embark on your next goal, remember you need to hustle, sacrifice, be gritty, persevere, be flexible, have a positive mindset in order to experience success. I speak for all of the staff at the adult school in congratulating you on the hard work you have put in this year. Thank you for sharing this part of your life with us and remember that we are here to support you in whatever your next steps may be. Congratulations. Here to announce both special awards and student speakers are Janie Mitchell, our adult school secondary instructor and Aaron DeGracia, the adult school assistant principal.
Can I have Alicia Calderon please stand? Each year, the Fairfield Sassoon Adult School teachers nominate individuals for the Emily Inspirational Award. This award is in memory of a wonderful teacher who always helped and encouraged students as they work towards reaching their goals. This year, we are pleased to honor a woman who is an inspiration to us all. She never gave up on her goals of earning her high school diploma. Alicia Ponce was chosen by the faculty and staff to receive this award because of her dedication, persistence, and contribution to her classes. Alicia's name will be added to the plaque that is displayed at our school. Congratulations and best of luck on your future goals. Can I please have Katrina Crockett please stand? For the second award, uh, it is called the Chance to Rise, is a new award for the 2020-2021 school year for the Sopranos International of Central Solano County. This award is presented to the women in the Fairfield Sassoon community who have demonstrated courage and strength as they have overcome personal challenges and identified a path to their future. Achievement and well-being. This year recipient is our very own Katrina Crockett. I have the pleasure of recognizing the Barbara Henson Memorial Award recipients. This year we had three students complete this educational journey. May I please have the following students stand. Maria Alvarado. Ivan Cervantes. Nice job, Ivan. And Florencio Perez Ruiz. Barbara Henson was an adult school ESL teacher who encouraged her students to continue their education after completing their ESL studies. This award is presented to ESL students who have done just that continued on with their education and reached their goal of a high school diploma or equivalency. Please join me in congratulating these three amazing students. Thank you. Today, we will hear from three student speakers who will share their thoughts with us on this special day. First speaker will be Jessica Calderon. Good morning, everyone. Going back to school has been something I have wanted to do for a long time. Back in early January, my youngest son was diagnosed with autism. I was told that he was going to have to start multiple types of therapy and school and that it was going to take 32 hours a week. I decided I could no longer put off going back to school to get my diploma. I knew it wasn't going to be easy, but I wanted to show my boys that it is never too late to accomplish your goals. My boys are my motivation to move towards starting a career so that I could be able to provide for them. Over the next five months, I had to set up a schedule to accommodate my son's therapy, my full-time job, school, and my family. It was the most stressful five months of my life. I was very lucky to have the support of my family, friends, and teachers. They continued to remind me what I was doing this all for. Now I am able to move towards my career goals. In August, I will be starting my phlebotomy program. One thing I have learned is hard work does pay off. Not only am I leaving today with a high school diploma, but also a scholarship from the adult school to Cal Original. Here's to moving towards the next chapter in our lives. I wish you all the best and congratulations to you all. Thank you, Jessica. Now I'd like to invite student Maria Rico Alvarado to share a few words. Good morning, everyone. How are you? I don't know about you, but I'm so happy to be here today. First, I would like to say thank you to the all teachers 
and the staff member at the adult school. Thank you very much for your hard work and dedication. Thank you very much. We all overcome for different difficulties to be here today. I start my journey as an ESL student, and here I am, ready to go to college. It's never too soon or too late to have an education. We should be so proud of ourselves. We did it. We all are here because we want to have a better life, a better future. We all us have taken one step forward to having a better life and better future. Dream big. Never stop following your dreams. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, Maria. Finally, I would like to ask Katrina Crockett to come to the podium. Good morning to everyone and congratulations to all my fellow graduates. We did it, guys. I want to acknowledge and give thanks to really everyone that helped me, but especially Elizabeth and Mr. Vadney and Rosa. Um, they helped me so much. And open, they opened doors for me and encouraged me along the way. In my life, I have faced many challenges, sorry, I'm so nervous, and discouraging obstacles. At a young age, I became pregnant with my first child and I dropped out of school. With every child after this, the dream got further away. I had to manage my family, and so I decided to go back to school. I started in September of 20, and I completed in March of 21. Um, as time passed, the desire to complete my education continued to be in, impassioned in my heart, not only for the opportunities it presented, but also the example it was set for my children to follow. Once I got back into school, Mr. Vanny made it so easy to come every day. I had to relearn concepts I took for granted in daily life. And finally, I had finally done what I thought was impossible. It felt so good. I am so thankful to everyone who helped me and encouraged me. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing your stories with us. I, they're so motivational. And again, we're so proud of each and every one of you. And now the moment we've all been waiting for, formally honoring our graduates. So as high school equivalency chief examiner, it gives me great pleasure to honor those who have achieved the distinction of attaining their high school equivalency through the successful completion of the GED test. All of the GED candidates have already received their certificates, but we want to honor them and their hard work and have them walk the red carpet and be recognized. So I'm calling them up. Katrina Crockett. <laughs> Evelyn Garcia. Martha Gutierrez. Jorge A. Morales. Now I'm going to oh, yeah, sure. do this thing first. Okay. Congratulations.
And now we honor our high school diploma graduates. I hereby certify that these students have met the graduation requirements of the State of California and the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District. At this time, I will call the graduating class of 2021. All of the graduates have already received their diplomas, but we want to honor them in their hard work and have them walk the red carpet and be recognized. I also want to let you know that not all of our graduates could be present here today, but we will call their name to be recognized. Good. Yeah. Okay, I gotta stand here. Maria Alvarado. <laughs> Guadalupe Aguirre. Jose D. Aguirre. Marco Alvarez. Jesus Ambriz. Jose Luis Arias Jr. Miguel Angel Ariola. Patricia Ariaga Rivera. Sean M. Ashford. Denise Ashley. Elijah Atherton Kamakinya. Close. Jordan Bagos. Sonia Berber. Joshua Borjoquez. Melvin Bowers. Annalie Breed. Anila Breed. Thank you. There we go, it's applause. Shaniqua Brooks. <laughs> Sophia Monique Catherine Brown. Kayla Alessandra Bullock. Valerie Bersiaga. Jessica Calderon. Michael Caldwell. Veronica Mendia Candelario. Ivan Cervantes. Juan Jesus Cervantes. Zia Coleman. Zaya Coleman. Christopher Cornest. Ryan Costa. Jamie Coven. Ashley Lauren Cruz. Rafael Cruz Pino. Clyde Isaiah Cunningham. Kamani Cornell Curry. Michael Dakari. Matthew Dedman. Brandon Andrew 
Diaz. Julian James Hill. Denise. Ramses Salia Riyad Eid. Eric Ferris Busio. Holly Renee Fedor. Lakenya Fisher. Nancy Galvin. Maria Garcia. Vanessa Garcia. Oscar Garcia Gonzalez. Elias V. Gaxiola. Tania Renee George. Tania Renee George. Trayvon George. Jonathan Gomez. Andrew Gross. Alicia Gutierrez. Martha Gutierrez. Ashley Hurd. Guadalupe Naila Hernandez. Nayeli Hernandez. Karma San Hooper. Karma Sanai Hooper. Edith Hoyt. Jennifer Holtman. Derek Johnson. Raymond Kaloy. Prabjot Kaur. Miles Klein. Susan Lynn Kooks. Juana Laborio Romero. Kezia Lopes. Oscar Antonio Lopez. Rosa Acelia Lopez. Jocelyn McCrary. Anthony Mendiola. Anna E. Mesa. Felix Jose Mesa. Brenda Miranda Garcia. Fardbeg Mirza. Anya Marie Moore. Anaya Marie Moore. Avandre Moore. Huba Mujib. Wesley Myers, Dylan Neiman, Miani Norton, Woo! 
Jose Omar Ortiz, Marco Parra, Orland Pastor. Blanca Eileen Perez. Noel Perez. Florencio Perez Ruiz. Aaron Perry Jr. Felicity Pasarchik. Eduardo Platas. Elicia Ponce. Christina Quintero, Nathan Reese, Monique Requena, Christian Reyes. Valentin Rios Rodriguez, Jasmine Rodriguez Sanders, Tamra Rose, Sydney James Ruta, Amen Sali, Carly Sanchez. Nico Carell Sanchez, Claude Shaw the Third, Adrian Denise Sims, Somkith Temta. Raymond Taylor the second Ronan Thompson Jameer Tisdale Leslie Torres Yazenia Valle Godoy Alondra Vargas, Veronica Vargas, Jenna Noreen Von Striver, Anjane Waters, Makai Wesley, Daniel Westover. <laughs> Kira Williams, Marianne Williams, Joshua Robert Wright, Emily Yanez, and Imelda Zamora. Nice job, everybody. We're going to wait for just a second for everyone to get back to their seats.
just to let you know, we're chatting back here about how many graduates we have this year. And honestly, this is the most graduates we've had in a long time. And during a pandemic, again, it's just amazing what you all have done. So another round of applause. Can I add one thing? Yes. <laughs> and this isn't on my script, but as we listen to these fantastic stories from our student speakers today, I know a lot of the graduates from talking with you and families, each one of you have an amazing story on your accomplishment and where you are today. So be very proud of what you've accomplished today and families, make sure you celebrate and be very proud of what they've done, okay? And with that said, class of 2021, Superintendent Corey, members of the governing board, distinguished faculty and staff, family and friends. I certify that all of these students have met the graduation requirements of the state of California and the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District. Graduates, please stand. Now please move your tassel from right to left, signifying your accomplishment. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to give you the Fairfield Sassoon Adult School Graduating Class of 2021. It's been a long day without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again We've come a long way from where we began Oh, I'll tell you all about it when I see you again When I see you again Damn all the planes we flew, good things we've been through Then I'll be standing right here talking to you About another path I know we love to hit the road and laugh But something told me that it wouldn't last Had to switch up, look at things different See the bigger picture Those were the days, hard work forever pays Now I see you in a better place Ah, uh, how can we not talk about family When family's all that we got Everything I would do, you were standing there by my side And now you gon' be with me for the last it's ride It's been a long day Without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it When I see you again, I see you again. We've come a long way, yeah, a long way. From where we began you know we started. Oh, I'll tell you all about it When I see you again Let me tell you when See you again. First you both go out your way and the vibe is feeling strong and was small turn to a friendship, a friendship turn to a bond and that bond will never be broken, the love will never get lost. And when brotherhood come first, then the line will never be crossed Established it on our own when that line had to be drawn And that line is what we reach, so remember me when I'm gone How can we not talk about family when family's all that we got? Everything I would do, you were standing there by my side And now you gon' be with me for the last one 